Hello, and welcome to Band from the Video Store. I'm your host, Stray13, because the other story at Stray12 couldn't cut it. Today I'm bringing you the review of the on-demand, soon-to-be cult classic, in my honest belief, VHS. VHS is available on demand right now for $9.99. You can get, find it on Amazon. You can find it on um, PlayStation Network. You can find it on Xbox, three, six, or Xbox uh, Zoom movies or whatever. Fucking beautiful movie. I really, I'm, I am not a fan of these fan these uh, found footage movies, as you all know. I, I bash the hell out of Paranormal Activity, Paranormal Activity Two, Paranormal Activity Three, um, stuff like that. But the plot of VHS is pretty badass. It's a group of friends. They have you know they have camcorders. They go around causing trouble. They record it. They smash windows. They strip women down and, you know, show their tits and stuff like that. Well, they get paid to go to break into this house to uh, find one VHS, special VHS. And as they're breaking into the house, one of the guys goes upstairs and finds an old man. And it's a really fucking atmospheric movie, first and foremost. And so it's really creepy. When you're walking around this house, you're just thinking, okay, I can see what they can see. So in a way, it's kind of, like, visually, it's pretty similar to, uh, Quarantine. I, uh, well, anyway, the man goes upstairs, finds an old man sitting in a chair, and he's watching 15 different TVs, it looks like, and he starts, you know, he hooks up the, uh, camcorder to the television and starts watching the VHS copies of what this guy has. And they are awesome. It is an anthology. The very first story is the strongest. Then the very last story is the strong. Like this, you know, you go out with a, in with a bang, out with a bang. But there's, I believe, there's four stories. Uh, one of them involves a uh, group of friends. They have a spy camera and this guy's glasses. They're gonna go out and get laid and make videos. You know, make them videos of fucking chicks and stuff. Uh, the next one is a married couple on their vacation, and somebody is in their hotel room with them, and they don't know it. Third is a group of kids out uh, camping. I believe that's the last one. I'm I'm really trying to like I'm, I'm stretching for it if there's another story. Oh, well then their their story, which kind of like ties it all together, like the uh, rug and the big Lebowski. Now, I'm not a fan of shaky cams, I'm not a fan of a lot of these things that, that was in this movie, but I am a fan of horror. And I think this has really brought horror, like, back up. It, it's as good as, I don't, well, it's not as good as Trick or Treat, but Trick or Treat's going to be, like, the number one movie, horror movie, for a while, in my book. Um, but it's still very enjoyable. Love the movie. The cast, the directing, Ty Ty West di uh, directed one of the uh, little segments, which I was like, Ty, you you were too good to put your name, you know, try to put your name on uh, Cabin Fever too, but you thought that this this little thing was worth putting your name on, and I can see putting your name on it now for, you know, because you know the movie's gonna be cl a classic and it's gonna carry your ass, but uh, as far as just. Your, your your little segment it was not that impressive. I mean, it, it was creepy, but it was over too quick. There was there was no build up. You, you saw something and then that was it. So, you know, eh, you know, I was honestly a little bored during the, the Ty the Ty West directed segment, but still, totally fucking worth checking out. Oh, there was four. The fourth story was. A girl in a haunted, her apartment's haunted, and she's on a webcam back and forth with her, with her boyfriend. I can't believe I let that slip my mind. Because that was actually a really good one, too. There were some really creepy parts in it. And then the ending kind of left you like, son of a bitch. Definitely enjoyed this. Really, like, it was worth the ten bucks. Please check it out. This is Stray 13 for, band, for uh, all your... Horror and video game needs, check me out. I'm 
pretty much going to tell you exactly how it is. I'm going to tell you it's spoiler free. So feel free to subscribe. <laughs> you know, like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter at Bandstray13. And uh, I'll see you in the funny pages.